Next up, we have Marlena Cole from Bringing Together the World. Thank you for joining us today, Marlena. Thank you for having me, Maggie. Absolutely. So can you tell us a little bit about your organization and why you got involved? Yes, definitely. So my organization that I'm a part of is called Bringing Together the World. And our main focus is to kind of facilitate connections and friendships between international students and domestic students. The reason why I got involved was that I was a freshman when I first started. And you know, freshman year is just trying to establish yourself, find your interests, your niche, but also because of the idea of bringing together the world where I was able to meet international students and chat with them just about their life and relate to them. Absolutely. How has it really impacted your college experience so far? The friendships that I've gained from that club um, they're definitely lifelong. If I wanted to pick up a year or so from now and go to another country and meet up with someone there, I easily could. I still have that strong connection where I could, you know, chat and say, hey, let's go grab a cup of coffee or even like, hey, can I stay with you for a few nights? Very cool. Thank you. And I know you kind of talked about after college. So how has it kind of helped you prepare for the rest of your life in post-college? Bringing Together the World has given me the opportunity to kind of understand and work within an organization. It's definitely helped me understand how to delegate, how to work with people from other cultures within that setting, and how important every person is um, within that to actually make this um, organization happen on a day-to-day -day basis. Very cool, thank you. So you mentioned a little bit about what you guys do, but what would you say the purpose of your organization is? We just want to make sure that students, especially international students, have a comfortable and inviting environment that they can go to. Because it is a scary thing to uproot your life and come here for four years or even just a year. And so we want to make sure that they're able to have the utmost experience that they can. Mm -hmm, absolutely. And I know we talked a little bit about the virtuality of things, being that we are in a pandemic. How has that impacted your organization? What does it look like now compared to what it did before? In the past, a lot of our events had just focused on being in person because that's how you get that socialization. We have a side event that we host throughout our organization called Global Cafe. That's on every other Friday and you just grab some tea or coffee and you can just chat online about a random topic. COVID-19 has definitely impacted a lot of students' plans to study abroad. And so we've tried to make sure that bringing together the world can be another way where they can get that international experience or exposure. Absolutely, I, I can really relate to that because my um, opportunity got taken away from me as well. And I'm sure the same thing has happened with a lot of people. So it sounds like a great opportunity and a great place to meet new people across the world and here at GV. <laughs> Is there anything you want to tell everyone about how to get involved or where they can go to get more information on the club? Yes, we are on all social media. Our name is just BTW GVSU. And you can also find us on Lakerlink. We'll have our new general meeting times posted. So just keep an eye out for that. Um, and we'd definitely love to have you try it out. It's a, definitely a good experience and I highly recommend it. Perfect. Thank you so much, Marlena. I really appreciated it, and I'm happy that I got to learn a little bit more about the organization today. Thank you again for having me. Uh, this was great.